You know, scorpions are interesting little Ouch. creatures. Six legs, two claws, and a powerful stinger. Now, what if humans also wore exoskeletons to protect themselves? So an exoskeleton is mainly made up of chitin, which is a complex material found in insects and reptiles. Thanks to their exoskeletons, these tiny creatures can defend themselves and perform acts of superhuman strength. If you were a scorpion exoskeleton, you'd be able to climb up any building you wanted. With massive claws in the front, it would be easy to grab hold of things and even cut through them. Might be hard to open a bag of chips, though. But at night, you'd have problems – UV rays. They wouldn't hurt you or cut through you or anything, but you'd definitely glow in the dark. Not exactly ideal for sneaking up on someone. A scorpion's tail is venomous and packs a nasty sting. You could use it to sting anyone in your way. Plus, it's long enough that you could defend yourself from a safe distance. Scorpions live all over the world in some of the harshest environments, from freezing icy landscapes to scorching hot deserts. If it freezes, a scorpion can even thaw itself out under the sun. This next creature also has two claws and six legs, but it doesn't have a stinger. It's the mighty crab. Its shell is a lot more powerful than a scorpion's, and it's surprisingly quick. So you'd be seriously powerful in one of those. The downside is you'd only be able to walk sideways. And you'd be delicious to someone like me. There are almost 5,000 species of crab all over the world, each with special skills. In a crab costume, you'd definitely be a master digger. Sure, you'd be doing it sideways, but those legs and claws can get the job done. If there were crab-inspired bodysuits, they'd most likely be made for digging. You could even work underwater. You'd be agile, strong, and you'd look awesome. Humans in ant suits would dominate any construction site. Ants live in colonies around most of the world and rely on strength in numbers. But that doesn't mean each little ant's weak or anything, just the opposite. There are actually already exoskeleton suits out there to help humans do some heavy lifting. But to use the actual strength of an ant would be a game changer. An ant can lift around a thousand times its own weight. In a group, they can drag a bird across a field without breaking a sweat. What's even crazier is that they can carry things while they're climbing straight up a wall, or even upside down. Wow! Imagine a group of humans dragging a jet fighter up the side of the Empire State Building. There wouldn't be any need for bulldozers or cranes anymore. Just strap into an ant suit and get her done. Buildings could be inspired by those huge underground ant colonies. Ants are amazing at making tunnels. Imagine wearing a bodysuit that flies through the air like a stealth craft. If you wore a hornet suit, you'd have it made. They have a tough exoskeleton that's surprisingly light and easy to maneuver. Picture a fleet of strong flying acrobats. Oh, and don't forget the stinger. Most people think of hornets as pests, but they're not. They do a lot of good for the ecosystem, like eating up those pesky mosquitoes. Having a hornet suit would be essential for any kind of undercover work, not so much for office work. A strong aerodynamic bodysuit with a powerful stinger? Hey, sign me up! An armadillo uses keratin to make its bodysuit. You know, the stuff your hair and nails are made of? What makes it unique is that it's foldable and durable at the same time. It's made up of hexagon-shaped plates that go all over its back. When there's danger around, it can roll up into a ball. Scientists are studying how to make durable bending glass just like the armadillo's body plates. Humans wouldn't be 100% protected with this thing on, but they'd be able to withstand pretty much anything. You could jump out of a plane, no parachute, land on a rooftop, brush it off, roll off the edge, and land safely on a nearby car, all while being chased by tricked-out cars and helicopters. Nah, I've been streaming too many movies. Being one of the slowest animals on Earth does come with an advantage. You got a heavy shell on you 24-7 for protection. Just like armadillos, tortoise shells are made of keratin. What's sweet about its shell is that it grows with the tortoise. Crabs and other shelled animals have to keep replacing theirs as they outgrow them. Humans would be almost invincible if they wore tortoise suits, but they'd be insanely slow and draw a lot of attention. Still, if something goes down, you could just hide in your shell and wait it out. Hopping around from place to place would be pretty sweet, but what about flying? Grasshoppers can do both. 
they have a set of wings they tuck in behind them, which they unleash after their epic takeoff jump. Oh, and they come in all shapes and sizes, great for camouflage. Now, a grasshopper can jump around 10 inches high and 3 feet long. Uh, far? Uh, out? Well, that far. Anyway, it's all thanks to its back legs. Grasshoppers basically catapult themselves when they feel threatened or when they see something delicious. If you had a grasshopper suit, you'd be able to jump a whole football field in one go. You can forget about being stuck in traffic. It might not be the most powerful armor, but with those jumping skills and landing skills, getting your weekend shopping done would be a breeze. Or you could be the world's coolest pizza delivery person. Just imagine the tips! The biggest animal on this list doesn't really have an exoskeleton, but it does have a thick, thick skin. This massive beast's one of the most powerful mammals on Earth, and it comes with a strong horn near its nose for protection. Any guesses? Now, it might look scary, but that humongous rhino's an herbivore. It's not going to eat you. But rhinos do attack when they feel provoked, so keep your distance. Their thick skin makes them look like a tank, and it keeps them nice and warm. Now, with your rhino suit on, you'd have a monster advantage over the average human. The thick skin suit would be really useful for extreme weather conditions, cold or hot. And a horn on the top of your head would send a pretty powerful message. And it's not just beep-beep. Jaws that look like antlers? Six legs? Meet the stag beetle. Its oversized jaws are used for impressing its friends and sometimes for a little wrestling. But don't worry, these fearsome jaws aren't strong enough to hurt you. A human stag beetle suit would be pretty weird if you saw one walking down the street. But who knows what people will be into in 10, 20 years? Maybe this will be the future of wrestling. Now this reptile has the toughest skin of its kind. Crocodiles are fearsome animals, virtually unchanged since the days of the dinosaurs. Our modern-day croc is still top of the food chain, with scales on its back and a very soft underbelly. Its scales are made from some of the most durable materials out there. And don't forget that powerful jaw! It can crush watermelons like chewing gum. A human croc suit would be fast, strong, but mostly limited to hanging around lakes and rivers. It'd be a great thing to be wearing during a game of hide-and-seek, though. You're it! This last creature takes the grand prize, toughest exoskeleton ever. It's smaller than a rhino for sure, presenting the ironclad beetle. Even the name makes people's knees weak. This beetle has interlocking wing covers that make it twice as strong as it should be. But get this, it doesn't even fly. Yeah, it doesn't need to escape from danger. Whatever you throw at it, it can't be hurt, dented, or even crushed. Not even by a car! These beetles can live up to two years, way longer than other beetles who only stick around for a couple of weeks or months. A human suit based on the ironclad beetle? Wow! That name gets me every time. It'd probably be resistant to just about any collision. Walking through moving traffic would be like strolling in the park on a warm afternoon. This suit would be perfect for deep-sea exploration since it's resistant to pressure. That'd make it excellent for outer space adventures, too!